Hi, my name's Jason and welcome to the Clothesline Store. In this video, we're going to assemble and install the Hills Everyday Double Folding Frame Clothesline. Now, when you receive your clothesline, it's important to unbox it, which means take all the parts out and lay them neatly either on the floor or on a bench like we've done here. Then you take your manual, read it from cover to cover, check off all the parts, make sure you have what you're supposed to have to assemble the clothesline. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now we have the wall bracket in position, we're going to insert both the arms. Now when you insert the arms, it's important because it's a double fold, is to put the long one on the outside, and the narrow one on the inside. You put the end caps on which fit inside the bracket. And also another important tip, make sure the clip that retains the cord faces inward to the centre of the clothesline. So I'm going to go ahead and install this into the bracket now. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm filming anyway, yep. I think yeah, you should be able to see it from... So now we've got both arms in position, we go ahead and do the same to the other side and then we fit the spreader bar. So I'm just going to lift them up and go ahead and fit the spreader bar now. So now the brackets are on the wall, we're going to assemble the front spreader bars. Now being a double closed line you have two spreader bars, so it's really important to make sure you group them together so you get the two front larger bars and the two inner smaller bars and put them together. So what you do, you remove the cover from the inside joiner, you take the screws out and you place the joiner at the end of the spreader bar like so because you need to line up these two holes. Now it's really important when you tap this in that you line up the holes, you don't go too far. You really need to keep it in line with this so you can put the screw through. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now as we can see the hole is lined up perfectly. Now we're not going to put the cover on but we are going to put one of the screws in because what that's going to do is allow us to put the other spreader bar in the other end and not push the joiner in. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now we've put both the spreader bars on the joiner. We just go ahead and put the cover on, two bolts in, and then fit them to the clothesline. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now we've assembled the spreader bar, we're going to put it into the inner folding frame. So to do this, we get our corner piece. We just slide it in like so. We place this into the arm, give it a general tap. Then we come over and do the same to the other side. Now once they're both in position, we get our allen key and we just tighten them up like this. Now it's important to tighten them up very firmly because this will stop the arm or the front spreader bar from coming out of the arm. So it's important to do that. So once we've done that, we're going to move on and put the spreader bar on the outer arm so I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now we've put the inner spreader bar in. I'm going to do the same to the outer spreader bar. So once again, we put our corner section in to the spreader bar. Give it a general tap. We put it into the outer arm frame. Give it a tap. Repeat the process over here. So once we've got the corners in, we then tighten up the clamps. Now it's really important to do them very tight. 
If you don't, the spreader bar will come out. So I'm going to go ahead and tighten them up. And we do that for both ends. Once we do that, we put the plastic cover back on and then we thread the cord. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So now it's time to fit the cord. So here's a quick tip. Unravel the cord before you start. It makes the job a whole lot easier. So let's go ahead and do that now. We get our end clip, we put it on, and we thread the cord through the end clip. We pull it firmly and tie it around, put our clip on, and then we thread the cord. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So once we've put the clips on, cords are all installed. That's all that's required when we put up a Hills Everyday Folding Frame Clothesline. My name's Jason. Thanks for visiting the Clothesline store and bye for now.